start. Pika Ditto's on Metal Cavern. Yeah, tiny, tiny little stage. Dark Horse been playing his new Pikachu all this season. I don't think I've seen him play anything but Pikachu. Pretty interesting. He's tired of those foxes. Those freaking foxes. Yeah, he's tired of Falcons, yeah. Oh, he's just jabbing the crap out of GT. Oh, Metal metal Cavern's so broken. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, almost had a really good chain there. Good read on the down air. Oh, GT, nice sweet spot. Oh, I have a feeling with my uh, one up B rule, I'm going to get counterpicked to janky stages. <laughs> oh, so far out there. Oh, and then down B! Dark Horse ran out of ideas and he just said, he just said screw it and down B edge guarded GC. Oh, he got caught with the up tilt. Oh, nice back air read from GT, just kind of YOLOing it and. Yeah, then Dark tries to do the one up B of his own and it doesn't work out. Or their recovery. Uh, GT. Almost had a nice little chain there. Good recovery. Uh, gets the grab. GT, GT really looking like he. Uh, oh, he SDs again. Well, that was an interesting, uh, interesting ledge grab there. <laughs> Dark Horse cannot shield drop. <laughs> Oh, nice, nice pivot grab. Ah, uh, you can chain grab a zero. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, this stage is pretty, uh, pretty ridiculous. Oh, he got the L smash, and he got a strong there instead of weak there, I think, but a crazy good read with the back air. The down B read, not... <laughs> oh, and another back air read. Dark Horse is just killing him with these back airs. <laughs> Wait, Dane, did you have a 4 to 1 comeback? <laughs> no. There was that one game where he was at. The, the one game that I saw, you were up 4 stocks to 1. Or he would. Oh, and. Oh, you beat his Yoshi? Okay. Oh, good, good shit. Oh, uh, Dark Horse. Oh, he missed the grab! Oh, he gets the up smash! Dark Horse with a 3 to 1 comeback on GT in a game. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, 2 0. -oh. Yeah, you're right in the way, Dave. <laughs> J J Jason, you are you were saying you didn't have a 3-1 to one comeback? Oh. Oh, okay. Until you... <laughs> Yo, where is everyone on the stream? Oh, can we play on stream? Yeah. Yes. We got, we got time. Uh, yeah, it's like the, the, the audience is very active today. But the, uh, ow, god damn. So, so game one was on Metal Cavern. Um, they were both going for some really hard reads, like down B reads, back air reads. Yeah. And uh, Jason, Dark Horse, came back. He was down three to one against GT. Wow. Brought, yeah, he had a comeback. Wow. Yeah, the, um, the hard reads are. Oh, nice edge guard from GT. So I'm really thinking like GT is really leveled up lately. Um, oh yeah, definitely. I, I 
I always knew, like, when I first played him, he just switched to Pikachu, and I was like, hey, his spacing's really good, he just doesn't know Pikachu. Yeah. And he's, like, really picked it up. But he had, like, a really good breakout tournament at Shine. Um, got 13 out of, I think, 109. Oh, nice. <coughs> beat, um, beat Michigan's good second job, best. Uh, he actually only oh, lost, good. he lost to Mad Rush twice. Yeah. Um, uh, which was, uh, I think, it just like somebody messed with Dave's like bracket or something like that. That's the only reason he had to play Mad Rush twice. Um, but he did really well. Um, he's looking pretty good against uh, Jason Pika too. Um, Dark Horse has been playing Pika since season two started, I think. I still don't know why. And he said it's for Falcons. <laughs> I don't know if it's for the foxes or the falcons or what. Yeah. Oh, another good up tilt edge guard from uh, GT. It, it used to be that uh, that I'd have no trouble, you know, four stocking GT and occasionally I'd get five stock. Right. But uh, but he's gotten to the point where like he's trading games with me when I play box. Right. Right. Um, he's still got some weaknesses that I can exploit with other characters, but but it will not be long before those weaknesses disappear and he becomes. Did you see that hard read S match yeah. the other direction? That was that was wonderful. The Dark Horse is looking to make another three to one comeback. <laughs> oh, he's on the offensive again. Uh, GT's got him off stage, so. Alright, so GT actually closed that one out. Um, I feel like Dark Horse has missed a lot of up this set. Oh, he picked the stage with the least recovery options. So the Blast Zone's very small on this level. Um, Dark Horse looking to take advantage of that. Um, he's, had, he's been struggling with that Pico up B. Oh, hey. Uh, it was an interesting recovery choice. It looked like he was uh, trying to do a ledge cancel. I yeah, I seen GT kind of uh, working on those. Uh, I, think, I think it's very important to work on the uppies and a lot of uh, <laughs> nice up from Dark Horse called him out. A lot of um, Pikas need to work on their um, their uppie recoveries. Ledge yeah. cancels are a big part of that. Yeah. Um, you see some of the, like some players like Wario and Kiro and Derek and Stranded, like these guys are not only able to get the ledge canceled, but they're able to act off them very quickly. Yeah. And that's uh, one thing that makes Pikachu so strong. It's just the ability to immediately act out of his up B with a ledge cancel. Oh, and that blast zone. Oh my god. Uh, Dark Horse calls him out with another back air. And Dark Horse really loves his back airs. Um, honestly, that's probably my favorite spacing move with Pika, so I don't blame him. Uh, ooh, GT pushing him off the stage. You can oh, see. Um, catch him with the up tilt. Turn it GT into a combo. At this, GT at this point with the like the better knowledge of Pika, but Dark Horse is um, really kind of controlling based on his uh, experience and his abilities as a player. Um, GT has talent, but he's, he's not quite at dark level yet. Um, but like, Pika's a character where if you're, if you're more experienced than the other player, you can really exploit some of their weaknesses. Yeah, for sure. And um, Boom calls them mental dittos. Yeah. Because of the, uh, just the spacing style of the whole thing. Yeah, no, I totally agree. Um, Dark Horse is, is really good at those those mental games. Uh, I think he is the best player that I've ever seen at those. Uh, the mind games. Yeah. yeah. He just he knows what you're gonna do before you do. Yeah, I think that's. Um, Cheers always likes to think that's, uh, that might explain his struggles outside of Baltimore. Uh -huh. Just that he just. He knows us very well. Yeah. He hasn't picked up on his players. I forgot to update the score, but uh, it's uh, Dark Horse to beat GT 2-1. to one. It's a good, good showing by GT, but not able to close it out. 